Okay, campers. So I'm back out in the Australian bush once again. I've been digging up a few logs and rocks just to see what I could find. I found another bull ant nest that I'd like to show you. Just got the tripod set up in the tree, so the camera might be a little bit shaky. It's been quite difficult to set up for this. But just underneath that bit of uh, rotten log just there is the egg stash. I'm trying to get the camera in a good position so you can see all this happening. There we go. Just zoom in slightly there. Look at them all. All those ant eggs ready for the picking. So I've got a few in the in the cup already. Once you stick your fingers in there, just quickly release. Just quickly flick everything out of your fingers. So the bull ants are definitely slower than the human hand, that's for sure. Bit more successful than my previous video. Must have what about 20 or 30 eggs in there. Very high in protein and fat, so could be uh, quite fulfilling if you were stuck out in the bush. So in the meantime, I'll just put this rotting log back in place. Just cover up their nest. So if you were in a long-term survival situation. Um, you might sort of have the knowledge of where a number of these nests were and you come by every few days or every few weeks and just grab a few more eggs. So, and there you can see all those bull ants. Running around, they don't look happy. Where are my eggs? Where are our eggs gone? The queen's gonna be really angry at us. going to do a quick taste test once again of the raw blant larvae. Let's grab a nice handful of them here. So they're quite developed larvae. Just stick that in the mouth. It's quite milky on the inside. It's not a bad taste actually, I must say. This, these, these ant larvae taste better than that previous nest you saw in my old video. Not bad. It's almost like a milky taste. Don't let anyone tell you that you couldn't survive out in the Australian bush if you were lost. There's dry wood everywhere. You could easily make a campfire and survive at least a few nights. Eating what you find underneath logs and rocks. One of them looks like it's about to hatch pretty soon. 